Hello, my name is Don, and I wanted to uh, share with you a RV tire changing ramp that I decided to build my own. Uh, this is, I have a, a large fifth wheel trailer, and I know there are things that out there that are, well, one of them is called a Trailer Aid Plus, sells on Amazon for about $42. It's supposed to have a five and a half inch lift, but I've read many reviews that say that it really isn't enough to get the uh, second tire off of the ground for uh, removal. So I decided to make one that I knew would have enough lift. Mine, as it uh, as you see it there, is a six and a quarter inch lift. What I did was started with a two by six by eight foot long cost me about six dollars at Home Depot and then I bought uh, 12 of these galvanized lumber ties six inch long and I'll show you what they look like here what I've done is uh, cut them to different lengths depending on how many layers of this um, ramp you want to use either for driving on uh, to change a tire or just to use as leveling blocks. This is a dual purpose gadget. So anyhow, what I did was start with this uh, eight foot two by six. I cut it into uh, four different pieces, angled it at 45 degrees to make it a little easier to get the tire to go up it. The bottom is 34 inches long and the top is about 15 inches long. Uh, that's kind of just a matter of preference how, how you want to cut that, but so anyhow, I, for $10 total materials or, or less, I, uh, I built this thing. I used this quarter inch, uh, six inch long drill to drill these holes. And what I did was mark them all. Well, I first of all, I squared, squared it up using a, a square like this so that I'd get them all lined up. And I drilled these four holes. As you see, these are the pins now that I use as dowels, really. And it goes all the way through to hold the whole thing together. Now, the nut, neat part of this is I can take these out. I can take that layer off. And then I use one of these shorter pins that I cut off to the appropriate length. And I can put those in there. And as you can see... Now I have, those will go all the way down. Now I have a three layer ramp or leveling ramp, if you will. And I did the same thing for two levels. So you can take this off, use these shorter dowels, and now you've got a leveling ramp like that. So anyhow, I thought that uh, this would be a whole lot better alternative. If you think you can use it, uh, go ahead and try. Thank you.